multiplication times table sum. Today I am going to teach you another way to memorize a multiplication times table. Look at this table. Actually, there are some tricks we can use to memorize it. First, it's one. One times any number is itself. For example, one times one equals one. One times two equals two, and so on. And one times nine equals nine. So actually, we don't really need to memorize it. So we don't need to memorize this. For the third trick, you need to memorize all the numbers I have circled in red. These numbers are very important. These are the entries where you multiply a number by itself. For example, 3 times 3 equals 9. 4 times 4 equals 16. 5 times 5 equals 25, and so on. They are called perfect squares. If you memorize them, you can uh, figure out a lot of harder multiplication problems. For example, if you know 6 times 6 equals 36, then you know that 6 times 7 equals 6 more than 36, which is equal to 42. For the last trick, the um, numbers I have outlined in black have a twin down here. For example, 4 times 7 equals 28. And 7 times 4 equals 28. They have a twin. So we only need to memorize once. These are the tricks to memorize a multiplication times table. Um, I hope they help you memorize it. If you like me, please subscribe down to my channel. Thanks for your support.